Exit Gash's stronghold. What were Gut Gash's words? Now what? What were Gut Gash's words? Some bandit called Dimrim has a jag tip for the harpoon, called the tally. I'm gonna take it from him. Indeed? Yes, we need something stronger. Yes, but I, I doubt anyone will give this tally enough without a fight. I need it, I'll go get it. What happens, happens. Cool, so we could definitely use an upgrade to our um, harpoon. So, find Remedim's convoy. Alright, so it's a convoy, so that won't be as bad. Um, better than a camp. Really don't want to do another camp right now. And now that I'm like ready for convoy battle, I really don't mind doing it, but I just hate when I'm not expecting it. See? See how fast that was? Ah, <laughs> oh, crap. I need more water, too. I hate having to get health. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Let's lose those guys. They're fast, too. They always catch up to me. It's crazy. Even when I use my turbo. Hang tight. I'm going to discover. So I wonder if this is them or if I have to find them still. Those stupid little bugs messed my car up so quick. I have to find a spot where I can just get my car fixed pretty quick. Keep an eye out. No surprises. Come on, come get some. Well, my car is being fixed. Okay, because I think oh, whoa, whoa. Cause I think they're armored up. I wish I had armor. Yeah, see, I mean, that was much quicker and easier than that's still this car. So, yeah, I'm guessing I can return the vehicle to a stronghold to add it to your vehicle function. Well, I don't know if I should. No, let's just see if we can see if we can find this convoy right away. Uh, it's armored, but find Dimrim's convoy. Kind of want to take this back to my stronghold, but what is this? Oh, exchange tokens. Stupid camp, transfer camp. Oh, another one. Yeah, it's too far for... Ah, uh, it sucks. Let's get my car back, because... Mine has weapons in it, just in case I do find the convoy. Guessing fight left. Did you leave fight? Showing no viewers. Either way, I'll still uh, stream for a while. I really just need to do that stupid camp. That was 
bug in me. Again, I apologize. I hate to, uh, really hate to get frustrated like that and to show it, but there they are. But yeah, that was just no bueno. Up with them still. That was bad. Yeah, those armored cars don't mess around. They mess me up so quick. Hurry, hurry. Combo gets away, just keep following the route to find it. Okay. Well, I pretty much probably lost it by now. This, I need armor on my car. Those guys are just messing me up so quick. Yeah, and I mean, at least I have my harpoon in this one. I would have taken that, arm, that other armored car, but I don't think I could really do much with it. Let's try this again. At least I can find it again. And it's not like Grand Theft Auto where if you lose them, like, your whole mission's over. <laughs> you have to start all over again. That's what I thought was going to happen. Plus, of course, my health is low. Oh. Let's go get that water. Hopefully it's not a crazy mission just to fill up my canteen, but it's just the place I came to before. No, don't go back. With my luck, it's probably going to be like a crazy camp just to get water. See if I can last these guys before dying. Oh man. I definitely can't get it while they're attacking me. It's just horrible. Oh man. Tonight, hating it. Normally, probably die like one time. I know I only stream for an hour, but normally I only die once per stream in Mad Max. I've already died three times. I think four. I have health now. Let's just do that mission and we'll definitely call it now. I'm just not filling it anymore. Filling this mission, but just not filling anything after that. Now that I say that, I'm going to do badass now. Watch.
All right, come on. Let me get some luck back. Really what I need right now, because definitely not skill at this point. <laughs> my shotgun but that that'll work I honestly didn't even know I can do that in my car so that's cool at least I figured that out that way I can definitely use it against these guys this convoy alright come on Let's do this. Smashed right away. It's like four freaking cars in the console. That sucks. And you're done. Oh, do I have another bullet? Nice. Yeah, buddy. Nice. So I get sort of two. Those armor ones are horrible. Come on. This is who I need to get right here. Even though I'm sure those other guys will catch up to me. Yep, here they come. Come on. Oh, I almost got smashed right there. So just the armored guy, which is like the hardest one. Alright, come on. He's on fire too, so that's cool. Dang, he's messing my car up too. Nice, was that him? Yeah, buddy. Oh. 
But he's, in, he's on my car now. <laughs> Let's just go find a little a little hideout spot and I can check to see it. Oh, really, dude? Get out of your car. Yeah. Yeah, it's so tough when you're not armored up. That's so funny that he was on my on the hood of my car. Destroy Dimrim's convoy. Oh, he's got to destroy his truck. I was like, what? Look at this. Dude's wearing like a freaking thong. That's funny though that he just stayed on my hood. That is a good thing about streaming though. You can always catch those finer moments. So we have to destroy it. I think we have to destroy it. How do I want to do that? and collect the detachment hood ornament. I'm guessing that's what this is. Oh. No, that's what this is. Awesome. Do you want to install the hood ornament? Install front. Yeah, let's install that bad boy. Cool. So I guess that's the first one I've gotten. The talon has been welded into this monstrous hood ornament. We need to pry it out if we want to use it. Our best bet is G and his knowledge of weaponry, so... Oh, did we not put it on yet? Oh, look, yeah, look, cool, there it is. That's my first one. It's fashioned into a horde order, huh? An unprofaned figure. Made to bring luck amongst these heathen. This is a job for cheat. There's just a chance. He's a master of projectile and weapons and blasters. Let's just go to Jeet's. He's pretty close, so we'll, uh, we can save there, but... Finally, making some progress. Sorry, guys, I know I've kind of been a big baby tonight, but I just... I hate to stream and it kind of be for nothing, but... We ended up... We ended up doing what we wanted to with that camp, and now that was actually pretty easy. I just kind of like when everything goes smooth, that's not always the case, but... Sometimes I just want things my way when I'm streaming, and I can't always get them, but... Well, we may do. Thanks for sticking around. Whoop, almost wrecked into that car. And if you're watching on YouTube, definitely thanks for putting up with my... Horrible playing tonight. Just that, or either that, or just horrible luck. I guess both, maybe. But either way, we are progressing, so definitely stick to uh, stick to this series if you guys enjoy it. Leave me any comments on anything you need. Anything I could change, unless it's nights like this, where I really don't have any control. <laughs> but besides that, 
All right, let's see what Jeet says. Jeet has us all on feckin' corpse pickup duty. You put him. I heard him in the Orange News movie. I was no longer among the dunes. You got anything to do with it? Yes, I do. I'm the one who killed them. Let's see what he has to say. I hear a horse must tear down the jewel cases. That sounds like gut cash, John. But it's possible. With a pinch of black magic. What do you know? Ha! Oh, you got balls the size of blue juice. And you've done us some good, granted. So hear me. You'll need to get your harpoon reinforced to get through that first gate. Easy. But your biggest hurdle are those hinges. That's why it all calls for some black magic. Explosives. The Talon builds you an explosive jack tip. Right, right. Let's do it. Black magic, so... I'm wondering if that harpoon is already installed on my vehicle. If he slides us away, I'm coming off the you. Let's check garage. Oh, I can't go into my garage right now. Install the thunder poon. Oh, okay, so I, I'm guessing we're gonna do that now. Nice, select thunder poon. Is this yep? Install the thunder poon of tenants upgrade. Yep. Successfully installed. Awesome. Is there more? Oh, I guess I can get this one. Not yet, though. All right. Cool. I hear him. Do you? Big chief in Gas Town wants collecting. Shall we go get him? Let me just make sure I get this saved. I'm guessing once we. this out real quick. So I have five left, I guess. So let me just make sure this saves somewhere. Definitely don't want to do any of that again. I think, or wait, can I save myself? Auto save. I think I could. Do you want to overwrite this auto save? Yes. Nice. All right, guys. So definitely took us a while, but we got it done. Like I said, really sorry about my whining tonight. It was just so frustrating with all that crap uh, just interrupting me and whatnot. Besides the pizza, I get to eat that now. So. Um, like I said, I'm going to go ahead and read some of the games coming out. Um, we're almost in March, so we'll go ahead and see what's coming out here. Um, like I said, this may not be like too updated, but I know these games are coming out for sure, unless any of them, unless any of these happen to get like pushed back or whatnot. This is my list from GameStop, so like I said, sorry I don't have PC games. Not that I uh, have anything against you guys, but... For Xbox One, March, we got the Division. Yes, I'll probably get, I'll probably get that for sure. I've been waiting for that one. So you have the uh, okay. So we have three different ones here. So you got the regular edition for sixty dollars. Uh, the Division Gold Edition, which I'll probably end up getting. I got the gold for Rainbow Six. I don't know why. Just Tom Clancy. A you know, honestly, guys, it's probably worth it. Um, definitely worth it with the Rainbow Six, because 
Um, I don't know if anybody's played that, but with the gold edition, you were able to uh, get some of the um, operators a little bit earlier. I mean, I know it's not too crazy, but... And basically, you get all of the DLC that come out. You don't have to, like, go out and buy it. You automatically just jump on and download, so... If you want my opinion, I would definitely get gold. Uh, if you're going to play that game a lot. I mean, if not, you know, uh, definitely... Mm, so we got the Division Collector's Edition. I have no idea what that's about. I'll try to find out on my next stream. That way I can uh, let you guys know what, what that has to offer. That's going to be 160 so... Sometimes they're worth it, sometimes it's not. I mean, sometimes you just get like a stupid figurine or something. I mean, if... If you are a person that's gotten figurines before, sorry, uh, no offense, I just, I'm not really into that kind of stuff. Now, if it's like, I don't know what they could really offer with that, I mean, because gold, I'm guessing you're going to get all of the DLC or whatnot, I mean, maybe if you're getting, like, extra guns or... Something cool, sometimes they give... They give you guys cool stuff with uh, with collector's edition. So that's basically the main one. You also have on March 30th, uh, a drift is coming out, and then on March 31st, Trackmania Turbo. So I thought there would be more. Like I said, this list is just from GameStop, so there may actually be more coming out. But they're normally good about what's coming out and what's not. So. Uh, the Division, definitely look out for that. That's going to be March 8th. Uh, my birthday's on the 28th, so if anybody wants to... I'll probably have it by then, but... <laughs> if anybody wants to get me a game, March 28th is my birthday, so... Actually, not really. I'm getting old. So, PS4. Uh, same stuff. You're going to have... Or actually, on March 1st, you're going to have Republic SD. I'm guessing that might be an indie that's only $25, so I, have, I haven't heard of that. And then you're going to have the same choices for the Division. You're going to have the regular, the gold, and the collector's edition. Um, let's see. I mean, you know, I haven't bought a game for a while, so I might go all out and get the collector's edition. I'll actually Google that once, uh, once I stop streaming here and all. If you guys want to comment on this video and ask, I mean, it's easy. You guys can probably just Google it yourself. It'll be quicker, but if you guys want to know, let me know. I'll definitely, definitely let you guys know um, what it's all about on my next stream. And then, dang, I really hate that I have a PS4. Because on March 18th, I didn't even know it was coming out, uh, Uncharted 4, Thief's End. Um, which I could probably wait on because I haven't beat all of them yet, so... And I actually did want to get the Uncharted collection, but like I said, I... I already have enough games going on right now. I really don't need them. But for that, you're going to have a regular... ...edition at 60. You're going to have a... Uh, I guess this is probably a... I don't know what it is, but it's $80, so that's probably, like, DLC or whatnot. And then, uh, they're calling it Thief's Liber. That's probably, like, the collector's edition. That's going to be 120 so... Um, I, I like that game. I'm not too crazy into it, so I probably won't go all out for that. Um, March 29th, you have Agus of Earth Proto Assault. That's $40. And then, uh, March 30th, Adrift. So I didn't notice the price. I'm, I'm thinking that's an indie game because that's 20 And basically the same ones on March 31st, you're going to have Trackmania Turbo. So good games to look out for. I really hate, oh, I hate the fact that all these games are coming out because I can't even catch up with ones that have been out. I'm going to just kind of look into the future here. There's some good games coming out. I kind of don't really want to... It just sucks that I... Sorry, shower and stuff. Oh, no, you're good, man. I was just going over some of the games that are coming out. I, I ended up finishing uh, that last mission, so I'm going to be ending it here soon. But 
you have any questions about those games, I'm not sure if you really want to hear them or if you just want to check them out. I don't mind telling you. Um, basically, the biggest one that's coming out in March is the the division. I'm not sure. Did you get to play the beta? Actually, really good, man. I'm not sure if you're into those types of games, but so basically, you're gonna have a regular edition, a gold edition, and a collector's edition of the uh, the division. Um, like I said, I'll I'll look into it and let everyone know what the collector's edition. Is. You know what? Let me just go ahead and do that now. I'm pretty sure uh, it won't take long. Plus, I'm pretty interested in myself to see what it has to offer. Let's see here. The Division Collector's Edition. Heard a lot about that game. Yeah, it's good. I, I mean, I played the beta and it seems really good. It seems like one of those games that's going to last forever, too, though, which I'm kind of hating right now, man. I mean, I I love the fact that games are long, but like I said, I'm so behind right now. It's horrible. And then these, you know, these new games come out, and I'm kind of like, I want to play them, but I don't. Because then, you know, you end up starting a game, and you end up forgetting about the last one that you were playing, so... All right, so let's see what this is because this is for Xbox One, but I'm sure you're getting the same stuff with the uh, with the PS4. All right, so Tom Clancy's The Division Collector's Edition includes uh, the Division game. You get the season pass, which is probably what you're gonna get for with gold. Um, the season pass guys basically you guys know but it basically offers all the DLC that come out um, like I said with this uh, Rainbow Six you have operators um, basically like characters you're able to play those like seven days before everyone else which it's like man eh, but I mean it came in handy you know I definitely took advantage of it so you get a real agent watch what so, I mean, it looks pretty cool in the picture. Uh, I mean, it's a bit better than a figurine, I guess. But uh, you get a poster, which is like you can go out and get one. An agent armband and an art book. So, I mean, I would definitely do it for the art book. I'm into stuff like that. I mean, I may, I may go out and do that, but... I mean, it's not too crazy. Um... Like I said, just some trinkets if you're into that kind of stuff. Most of this stuff will probably end up, if I do get it, it's going to end up in my garage like a year later and I'm not going to have any use for it. But if you guys are interested in that or if anybody wants to get me that for my birthday, <laughs> March 28th. No, I'm just kidding. Well, not really, but um, you guys are more than welcome to get that for me. Like I said, I'll probably have the... Uh, the gold edition by then but if you guys end up getting me the uh, collector's edition I'll probably just end up selling my gold edition and you know making a little profit out of it but anyway guys like I said really sorry about the delays tonight um, I really do it more for you guys so that the streams run smooth but you know some days I'm gonna have just you know I'm gonna be playing horrible or I'm gonna run into problems and it, it was in the game it's not like it's you know stuff going out going on you know around me in the at home or whatnot but you know I had my mind set on that camp and then everything started going wrong so thank you so much for uh, all the people that stopped by tonight um, total gaming stopped by and then we also had what was his name Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm really bad with uh, names, but something about Kush, I think. <laughs> no. Um, anyway, yeah, he, he was uh, asking me about the Star Wars uh, car trader app. Really appreciate it, man. Thanks for actually asking me and trusting me with that. 
Um, I also have him now as a friend on, on the app, so I can probably hit him up and make some trades with him. But thank you so much. Plus, I don't have a little, I don't think I could side scroll in my chat here to find the name. I'm really sorry. I'm, my memory is shot. But um, also to fight, thanks so much, man, for stopping by. It's always good to see you. I really appreciate it, man. I really appreciate your support. All of you guys, anyone who stops by and just chats with me, I really enjoy it. I mean, I like talking games, so like I said, this is kind of like my, um, just my thing that I do, you know, to like relieve stress unless it's, you know, unless it's frustrating me. But uh, anyways, guys, yeah, thanks so much. I know uh, Knorr appreciates it. I really thank him for letting me stream tonight. That way I can do a little bit longer. Um, I think this is going to be regular. I think he said every other weekend he's going to be out of town, so I'll definitely take over these these nights when I can. Tomorrow I should be able to. Um, I know I work during the day, but um, like I said, guys, thanks everyone for stopping by. Definitely hit me up on uh, on our YouTube channel. Leave me some comments. Let me know what you think. I haven't really gotten any lately, but I love to hear from you guys. So. Thanks so much from uh, Knorr Connective for bringing you guys games from the past, present, and future. I'll see you all next time. Should be tomorrow, so stop by. Have a good one.